uh, I think that the design thinking is a great way to really uh, encourage our students to think together, uh, collaboratively working together, solving the problems, finding the solutions, and for real uh, issues. So when I was challenged with the issue about uh, Robin's Nest Cafe, how can we uh, keep the business going while uh, providing opportunities for our students to be uh, in a community, we came up with this idea, yes, our students, they can do it. And I was so excited about creating this class where students have an access to data, facility, business, right uh, day to day in the building, and they see, they live there, they see their uh, uh, student beha behaviors and doing research. That was a real problem, real data solution, and, and our students did it. I'm so proud of their accomplishments. And uh, this could be just one of the best things ever happened here on campus, bringing students together. Give them a challenge. They will rise to the occasion. I would definitely say that this is the most realistic and real world experience I've ever yeah. had in college. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We've had, in other classes, I've done a consulting-esque project, but this was for sure the most hands-on and the most realistic. Yeah. We did the research, obviously cut down from an entire semester to you know, a solid chunk of a third of a semester, but we actually went ahead and put these things into effect and looked at the impact that it had on not only our school, but the community that we've created here. Well, the entire school's vision was to have these like experimentally based, like real life application classes, and that actually like came to life this semester. So it was great to be a part of like the first class. And one of the coolest things about our campaign is that we negotiated with the Wisconsin Union an exclusive catering menu for the Robin's Nest Cafe. And so no other Badger Market has this catering menu. And it's really special to the Robin's Nest Cafe and it kind of makes us unique, which we are. Yeah. So it was a hands-on experience with this project. Um, most of the classes that you take for the retail program have projects, but this one was different in the sense that we were actually working with a business and we were able to see our results and craft results that we thought would really benefit and leave the Robin's Nest Cafe in a good, profitable, and sustainable position. I almost saw it as if it was an internship because you were working with real people's money and you had to make sure that you weren't going to waste it away and that in the end you'll be able to see what you've impacted and the results that come from it. Working with the class, the ideas started coming together and they were really, I thought, some very good ideas. The cafe just took off immediately with everybody abuzz about what was all going on with these projects and what they were trying to do and everything like that. That it was the biggest start for a unit that I've ever had in, in my 25 years working with the Wisconsin Union and starting uh, 17 other units already. So it was pretty amazing. I learned how to work in a group and like strategic planning after this too. Like I could potentially see myself working for a nonprofit carrying out strategic planning, which is a group setting too. So this class was like really good preparation for that. Um, well, the course was a lot different than any other course I've taken at UW because we learn a lot about all the different skills and um, mindsets and things that you can use in the real world, but we never really get to apply them to real world situations. Um, so we can read them in textbooks and write about them all we want, but being able to implement them and really see what the end result is um, has a really big impact on us and to the School of Human Ecology. And then you changed your furniture again, and all of a sudden it was back to being yeah. like that. Yeah. Just that, you know, the impact of the things that you guys have planned and implemented was amazing. I thought it was funny.